I'm currently being courted by two girls at the same time. What? Can you see it? Hmm, I can show you. Her name is Maki Akuri. She's a sophomore in high school like me. And she's attracting me now. She has a devilish personality, which is very annoying to me. A healthy high school boy. Jeez. Um, I'm embarrassed when you stare at me like that. No problem. Let me take a look. No, you can't. You can't go on such an unhealthy temptation. The girl who said that was Seri Amamiya. She is my classmate who is always trying to attract me with Maki. She has a serious personality and is strict about unhealthy things. Don't interrupt me. You were a little embarrassed just now even though saying that. Um, that's... Nozomu-kun, let's study together. I mean, in my room. Just the two of us. You're unwholesome too. What? Just the two of you? You're totally seducing him. I didn't mean it like that. No, no. You were asking him out no matter what you think. I mean, aren't you unwholesome? It sounded like I was seduced by her too, but Sari would make naturally and unhealthy comments even if she had no intention of doing so. <sighs> Since Sari-chan is serious, I guess it's really just studying in her room together. The healthy high school boy that the devilish Maki and the serious Sari are competing with is me, Nozomu Hondo. I mean, what's wrong with Nozomu? You've been silent since a while ago. Yes? What's wrong? Well... I want you to see the inside of Maki's skirt, but on the other hand, I thought it would be nice to go to Sari's room to study together in an unhealthy way. I've been wondering which one to choose. Um... Okay. Let's do this. Let's have Maki show me the inside of her skirt while we study in Sari's room in an unhealthy manner. Whoa. Oh well, both of you should like me, but you're turned off. I don't get it. Well, I'm not really going to show you. I'm not going to study in an unhealthy way. What did you say? You're really faithful to your desires, aren't you? Yes, on the contrary. It's good because it's easy to know how to appeal to you. I agree. If I make my skirt flutter a little, you will look at me as if you were devouring me. What the hell? Well, wait, Maki! You can't do anything unhealthy! Hey, how much did my likability level go up now? About 100 million points. Aren't you too easy? You, Nozomu... Even if you look at me like that, I'm a healthy high school boy. I'm at the age where I want to do my best to be a good boy. Isn't it a man's nature to look at a cute girl as if I were devouring her? Why did I fall in love with you, Nozomu? Yeah, really. Sometimes I don't know why I fell in love with this guy. I really wonder why. My encounter with the two of them was a small thing. I picked up Maki when she ran away from home for family reasons. And after letting her stay at my house for a while, I had a little chat with her parents and solved her family problems. Sari was being tangled up with a perverted stalker, and I happened to see her and helped her out. That's when we started talking. Well, it was a nothing special encounter like this. I didn't think that Nozomu was such a guy at that time. If I had known his true nature, I might not have liked him. That's a terrible thing to say. But, well, it's a weakness that made me fall in love with you. No matter what kind of person you are, I will accept you. Then study with me in an unhealthy manner. Unwholesome is forbidden. Oh no. Oh then, will you do something unhealthy with me? By all means, please. So you're too faithful to your desires, aren't you? N Nozomu, if that's the case, let's have a healthy study with me. It's alright. I'll teach you everything you need to know step by step. You'll teach me how to do it step by step? I'm getting excited! Huh? Why? This girl is no good. I have to do something quickly. And so, as a healthy high school boy, I am faithful to my desires. I am confident that if I am tempted a little, I will easily wag my tail and go along with it. I live my life according to my desires. Like elementary school children who follow them when they say, I'll give you a candy bar, come follow me! It is no exaggeration to say that I live my life for the sake of being a pervert. Knowing this, Maki and Sari's appealing methods are also rather direct. Oh, it's getting hot in here. 
Maybe I should unbutton the first button of my blouse a little bit. Nozomukun is not going to fall for such a classic temptation. What? Oh, he's so caught up with it! Well, I'm embarrassed by the fact that you're staring at me so openly. What? You seduced him, didn't you, Maki? Yeah, right. But there aren't times when he stares at a girl's chest like he's devouring it without taking his eyes off me for even a moment in such a stately manner. Oh no, Nozomukun, it's forbidden to be unhealthy! Whoa! You're the one who's pressing your breasts against Nozomu's! I'm not trying to do that! I did it to stop you, didn't I? You're pretending to be serious, but you're the most unhealthy person I've ever met, you sullen little bitch. What do you mean? Well, you two, calm down and let's have some fun and do something literary. It's your fault for not being clear, isn't it? Nozomu, please decide whether you want me or Maki. Oh, yes. I'm sorry. I don't know what to say about that. All right, now this is how it's going to be. Sari, let's play a match. A match? Yes, if I win, you get to keep Nozomu for a day. A whole day? If I gave such a right to Maki, I'm sure that Nozomu-kun's likability will rise so quickly. He will be completely turned down within a day. <laughs> so I will do it. I'm sure you're right. Even if I win, it's easy to win his heart. I'm sure it's a high-risk, high-return thing. Wait, I'm not so blind as to wag my tail at anyone, you know? Hmm. <laughs> what? I can't get them to believe me at all. Nozomu-kun, you should take a look back at what you've said and done in the past. I'm not looking back. Oh my god, you're so cool. Maki, I don't think that was anything cool. I know, I was just making a random compliment. What's the point of that? Look at him. <laughs> right? I knew it! He's too easy! And so, the matter of the match was left unsettled. Ah! Uh, why is Maki-san here? What are you doing here, Sari? You're so dressed up. You too, Maki. I was thinking of asking Nozomu out on a date since it's my day off. What? Are you making a promise or something? I'm not. I was going to surprise him by showing him my clothes. How about you, Sari? Uh, I'm similar to you. I see. In other words, the first one to reach Nozomu's house gets the right to a date, do you agree? I guess so. After all, the last game ended up being a dead end? So I was doing... What? Huh? What? That was... Uh, Nozomu, right? Yes, I'm sure that was Nozomu-kun, no matter how we look at it. <sighs> Nozomu is fine with anyone as long as they're a little bit naughty. I guess so. Okay, let's sing. Let's sing and forget. Yes, that's right. Alright, I'm going to sing a lot today. Come on, Sari. Sing a song too. Yes, I know. I was so shocked that I turned into a bot. You've already put ten songs in, Mackie. They're all heartbreak songs. <laughs> oh, Maki san is so shocked that she is emotionally unstable. Because I worked so hard, but he doesn't care who. He likes whoever! So shocked! Um, Maki-san, can I sing with you? Yes. Please listen to this duet between two heartbroken women. I can hear a very tragic song about lost love coming from this room. The next day. Uh. <gasps> hmm. The tension between the two is very low in the morning. Speaking of the end of the holiday, it is always the same. Since I made you feel lonely on your day off, I'm going to give you a service today. You can't look at it! Don't, Nozomu! Don't press your breasts against the back of Nozomu's head while saying that! I'm tempting him right now! No, this is... Whoosh! They try to crush my eyes in various ways, like this, from the morning! But what about today? 
The air is heavy. I see! I guess it's a girl's date today! Wow! Oops! You look at me like you're looking at garbage. It's a treat for us! Now let's return to the main subject. So, what the hell is going on with you? You don't seem to be in good spirits. Sari, why don't you tell him? No, you talk, Mackie! I don't have the courage to ask. Neither did I! I understand. Let's play rock, paper, scissors to decide. I understand. So, is it really that difficult to talk about it, even playing rock, paper, scissors? Well... Yes. Come on, hurry up. I saw Nazama walking with a sexy woman yesterday. Sexy woman? Who is it? She looks like this. You're the one who's been taking spy photos. No, no, I didn't mean to. So, why were you too depressed? I thought that Nozomu-kun was tempted by the sexy woman and followed her around. I thought that Nozomu would be fine with anyone as long as they would do something sexy. What? You were depressed because of that? Oh, that's not what I meant. Can you think of the feelings of women who have stolen the crush by a stranger? No, she's my sister. What? I was just out with my sister. Eh? Why are you so surprised? I mean, do you think I'm a jaded person who would follow anyone? Yes. <laughs> ah, yes. That's right. I'm a healthy high school boy who is living my life according to my desires. But it doesn't mean that I accept anyone, you know. Well, it's the two of you that make me... excited. And I'm trying to choose between the two of you in my own way. That's why I've decided that I'm not going to run away from any appeal from the two of you. Ah, so you always took advantage of our temptations? Of course! My first priority is that I want to do this and that. I was almost moved for a moment, but not at the last minute. I'm happy for you. If we were moved by this, we'd be in trouble right now. That's a terrible thing to say. Uh, and these are presents for both of you. What? What's this? It's a pretty accessory, isn't it? Matching accessories? You know, the two of you got mad at me before because I didn't make myself clear, right? I thought it was about time I made myself clear too. Well, I guess it's my way of apologizing for making you wait until now. I asked my sister and had her pick them out with me. <laughs> well, since that's the case, I'll choose properly from the two of you so that you can both be satisfied. So I'd appreciate it if you could wait until then. Huh. <sighs> yes, I can't help it. So, I'll wait for you. I'll wait for you because it can't be helped. Thank you. I'm glad to be tempted by you two a little more, to be honest. I, I guess, guess that's, that's the, the reason, reason after, after all. Ha! <sighs> I'm sorry, I was just being honest. And so, it seems our relationship will continue for a little while longer. Nozomu, you always call yourself a healthy high school boy, right? Yes, that's right. I'm a perfectly healthy high school boy. No matter how you think about it, Nozomu-kun is an unhealthy high school boy. No, I don't think so. What would a high school boy who is faithful to his desires as I am do if he is not healthy? It is rather unhealthy to keep one's desires hidden, isn't it? What is healthy about a high school boy who always has two girls at his side? Oh, it's true. He's convinced. I understand. Then, I'll decide right here and now. What? Suddenly? Why? I'm not prepared for this. <sighs> Look, Sari. You're almost hyperventilating from nerves, too! Because if I don't do this, my identity as a high school boy will be ruined! I'm the only one who should be judged on such a basis. Or rather, you don't have that kind of identity from the beginning! 